Hello everyone, in this video we're going to go through the steps to upgrade to Windows 10 version 20H2 while keeping your files and settings. Although upgrading to the newest version of Windows 10 is usually an easy process, it is always recommended to create a full backup before proceeding in case you need to roll back. You can check the video description to get the link to watch the video with the steps to do a full backup of your computer. Microsoft supports multiple ways to upgrade to a new version of Windows 10. In this particular video, will be using the media creation tool to perform an in-place upgrade. If you are already running version 2004, use the Windows settings to upgrade because if you use the media creation tool, it will perform a full reinstallation of the operating system. You should only use this method if you're upgrading from an older version such as version 1909 or older, or if your device is having performance issues. Before proceeding, to avoid problems, disconnect any peripherals such as printers, Bluetooth devices, USB drives, and external storage. You only need a keyboard, mouse, display, and an internet connection. Also, it is recommended to uninstall older software, security applications, and more importantly, third-party antivirus. You can always install them back after the upgrade. If you don't do this, you are likely to run into issues during the upgrade. To install version 20H2, you first need to download the media creation tool from this Microsoft support website. I will be leaving the link in the video description along with the release date on when this feature update will be available for download. And here's the warning, if you download the tool before the feature update is available, it will not install the new update. Well, in the website, under the Create Windows Installation Media, click the Download Tool Now button to get the tool. Once downloaded, Double click the file to launch the setup. Click the set button to continue. Select the upgrade this PC now option and click next. Click that set button. Now we're ready to install the 20H2 update. Before the installation, make sure that the keep your files and apps option is selected to not only preserve your files and apps, but also your settings. When you're ready, click the install button to begin installation. And now you have successfully upgraded your device to version 20H2. The entire process should take less than an hour, but it will depend on the hardware and your internet connection. You can confirm that you're running version 20H2 using the About page on the Settings app. And under Windows Specification, confirm that 20H2 is installed on your computer. Please make sure to check the video description for important information such as the release date of this version of Windows 10 and much more. And remember that if you try to use the media creation tool before the app that is officially available, your device will not install the 20H2 update. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet, and I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.